I chose the role because I mean, it's just a sensational part to play. You know, Jed Mercurio, who uh, behind Line of Duty and behind The Bodyguard, who is our executive producer, it's the first production he's done with his independent production company. I would wanted to work with him for a long time, and when we finally found this, the, the, the writer Chris Brandon is a new, he's, he's from Down, County Down, a new writer, sensational character he's created, um, a wonderful thriller. Confirming it's his vehicle will take a little longer without the normal plates. No bodies, explosives? David nothing. This isn't a phone call. A handful of us were made aware of a possible assassin who, it seemed, had access to police intelligence. He was never identified, but the suspicion was that it could only have been an inside man. We called him Goliath after the career. I love coming back home. You know, I've lived uh, in London for 35 years, but I still consider this very much home. Um, and you get to work with some of the best, I mean, the best crews, really, because, you know, it's, it, it's one of the great you places in the world to film now. So, um, uh, you know, it's win, win, mm -hmm. win, really, for me. He also murdered my wife. It's been an absolute joy from start to finish, and working with Jimmy, Nesbitt has been a revelation. He's such a generous, passionate actor. And uh, I really loved every day on set coming in and the, you know, playing with the kind of the chemistry and the sparks between us and quite a feisty character. And yeah, I just, I loved it. Make sure everyone has a photo of Keenan. 